Luther, after last week's performance, how much was it stressed to you guys that it'd mean nothing if you didn't back it up this week? Yeah, I mean, if we hadn't got this little victory, you know, we would have been disappointed. Uh, I don't think we've ever came here and, and beaten Harlequin, so, you know, stuck to the game plan tonight. We adapted to the conditions really well, and, you know, thankfully the boys dug deep and, and managed to get that victory. You mentioned the conditions. As a back, when you look out the window and the weather's like that, you've got a game in the evening. Uh, what's the feeling? Well, as a 12, you know, it's all about getting that gain line. So I thought I was going to be that extra forward today. Um, and a fair play to our forward pack. They, they dug deep and they got the malls going and, you know, really put Harlequins under pressure and vice versa. Um, so, yeah, you know, it's, it's never pretty rugby in these sort of conditions, but we'll take, we'll take the victory. You never know how things are quite going to pan out in the season, but a side like Harlequins are already going to be in and around the top four. How much of a mental boost is it to beat them on their own patch as well? Yeah, it's a massive mental boost. I mean, we came here last season and didn't win. We came here the season before and didn't win. So to come here, you know, this time around and get that victory, whether it be pretty or not, you know, we'll take them. You know, four points later down the line, are going to be massive for us. Gloucester away next week as well. Um, another tough trip. Yeah, a very tough trip. You know, going to going to the shed, they're going to be very, very tough, tough opposition. You know, the, the crowd are going to be on our back. They've got some smart players in Billy Twelve Trees and Freddie Burns. And they've got a dangerous back three, um, so we're going to be on, be on our, have to be on our metal. Um, but we'll enjoy this victory, we'll enjoy the weekend, and we'll you know get to the join balls Monday and focus on Gloucester. We talked about it quite early on um, before we came here. Defense is going to win us the game, um, especially in these conditions and playing a quality side like Harlequins. You know, top four contenders, really sharp, and some quality players in the teams. Um, we did talk about defense, and it did win us the game. I guess you guys look at the weather a bit in the week leading up to a game, but when you get to the ground and it's as wet as it was tonight, does the game plan have to change? Yeah, it does, um, but we, we can't control the weather. All we can do is adapt to it, and whatever that is, we just got to adapt quickly and you know stick to our guns and getting the forwards working, getting the ball to Stephen who can plug us into the corners, and you know just like, like we did tonight, our defence was really well, so we just stick to that. First start for you in Saints Colours, how, did, how much did you enjoy that? Uh, yeah, I didn't enjoy the weather so much, but being out there, be, uh, first up in the Saints Colours, I really enjoyed it. And, uh, you know, just the fans who turned up here was pretty amazing. Um, and last week, experiencing that with all the fans there, you know, it's, it's pretty cool as a player, and especially a new player coming in, it's just, you know, very overwhelming. You talked about a team game plan due to the conditions. As a nine, uh, we saw flashes of what you can do tonight, but do you think to yourself you've got to play a little bit differently as well? Yeah, I definitely have to kind of adapt to it a lot. Um, I'm still learning the way um, we play as a team. It is a team sport. I yeah, just got to stick to our strengths, and that's our forwards. You know, they're really good, especially in these conditions. They gave us some good quality ball. I just got to fix up a few execution parts of my game. Um, but there's always work ons, and I'm still learning the game as well, you know, that's, that's the beauty of it. Each week you learn, you learn, you learn. So um, I'm just looking forward to the next, next game.